Friday Night Bakes update. So I'm just back because I was away. I was away getting myself a pizza. Look. Oh, and I got a strawberry milkshake. And obviously, garlic dip. Beautiful. I haven't had a takeaway in ages. Like, I say ages, definitely a couple of weeks, but like, before anybody comes at me and says, Kim, are you not a dietitian? Why are you eating pizza? Excuse me, everything in moderation. The problem is if you eat pizza all the time, treat yourself, okay? So I'm going to enjoy my pizza. Also, look how good my two turned out. Look at her. Oh, like baked to perfection. So the other one's just ready to go into the oven because I only have one mold of each of them. So I can't do like two at the same time. So I have to do each bake individually, which does take a wee bit longer, but it's totally fine. No stress. It just means I have more time to enjoy my pizza. Mayo dip open. So my pizza order is small okay so i get a small and i get half pepperoni half barbecue base with chicken and bacon i don't know if that's a crime but i love it okay so we're going on pepperoni first oh mm, 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 mm. oh i'm washing down with some strawberry milkshake Beautiful, sensational. Okay, update, time is literally 1.02 a.m. So that means if I wanna get up, I'm training at nine. To be honest, ideally, right? This is ideally. I would love to get up at like half six, seven, stretch, take Teddy for a walk, even if it's just 20 minutes, come home, get a coffee, get ready for the day, at that point, it would be what, like night? It would be like coming up to like quarter past eight so I could get coffee, half eight, go over to the gym, chat shit, and then train. Like that would be the key morning. However, that would mean I only get five hours sleep. So, and whether or not I fall, like, I don't know about anyone else, but like, I don't fall asleep straight away. However, I've been starting to take my magnesium more regularly recently. And I have to say, my sleep has definitely improved. So anyway, that is not medical advice. I would just like to preface. However, anyway, we're gonna go nap now. So I'm gonna, I'll set the alarm for seven. That's gonna be, I'll set it for seven and then, yeah, I'll set it for seven. We'll see where we end up. Okay, good night. show you fit. Sorry this room is a mess. So we've got my bootsies on, got my knee head boots, shirt, skirt and the hair is kind of flat. That's okay, I'm happy with it. Okay, off we go. what I had never played poker before in my entire life but it's actually so fun and you can kind of understand why people get addicted to it like it makes sense like we we were there for from seven till literally 10 to 12 and then I went and got myself a McDonald's this has been this vlog exposes me deeply because of the pizza and then the McDonald's tonight but you know what I was at maintenance this week and we're going back into our deficit literally starting tomorrow so do you know what I don't want any judgment Thank you very much. No judgment needed for having a little cheeky cheeseburger and chips. Thank you very much. Anyway, so I also rarely ever do winged eyeliner, but I was actually vibes, feeling the vibes. Does anyone use eyelash serum? Because I don't have any. And I was thinking of getting some because I feel like these need to grow. But anyway, that's just me being ridiculous. But yes, back to the poker. So turns out I'm relatively good. Like at one point, out of everybody, I had the most chips, okay? Like, I, I had like 140k in chips, not that we were actually playing for 140k. We were playing, I think the top prize was 250, then it was 175, 125, and then 50 pound. So that was the crack, and like, it was a fundraiser, bear in mind. But like, you know, Monopoly money, and if I'm running, 
I was winning at one point, and then I thought, right, Killing, can't hold on to these chips for too long. I've like, got to start playing because I was playing safe. I was playing too safe. And what happened was I started getting greedy. I was like, no, no, I want to win. Like, I actually want to win. Because when I realized then I actually was kind of half decent at it, then I, I got all cut up and I started playing too hard and I lost all my chips and then I ended up being out. But it was fine. It's okay. It was a bit of crack. And next year, it's my fucking pot. I'm coming for it. But I, so the time is now, I just got home there. The time's now half 12. Oh, here, before I get changed, I forgot to tell you, I ordered another pair of shoes. I need to stop. I need to stop right let me show you so behind this I'm so easily influenced I'm too easily influenced right so I you know Olivia May I don't know if any of you know her she's Australian oh everything she does I'm obsessed I love her she's like an Australian sprinter but anyway she put up that she got these shoes in the Black Friday sale they're the Adidas Addy Star can you see right hold on let me get this sorted here there oh my god I'm so excited, but I don't think they'll be here in time for this vlog when I finish, so I'll have to show you them when I come, when they come, that they're coming next week, so I'll, I'll put them in the next vlog, but anyway, yes, I'm so excited, and these aren't going to be like, they're meant to be an easy runner shoe, but I personally don't think I'm going to wear them for running, I think they're just going to be like a, like a style shoe, if that makes sense, but anyway, yes, I'm addicted to shoes, if you ever want to get me a gift, you know what to get me, get me a pair of trainers, okay, right, bedtime. No, you're joking, you're absolutely taking the hand, I just checked. I recorded myself there for about 40 minutes after I got home from work and uh, I recorded myself in slow motion which means even if I sped it up my voice is not going to be in it so lol we'll go again I'm just gonna have to summarize so basically I slicked my hair back in a really like different way today like, I tried to do it lower this time because I don't know what it is I'm trying to grow my hair here okay I know I'm being dramatic I'm being dramatic but I love it if it's like, I want it to grow here. So I've got like rosemary oil. I got like the head massager thing and all. But the only thing is I only wash my hair once a week. So I can only do the rosemary thing once a week. But I, I don't think you're meant to do it any longer than that. Anyway, but that's fine. So anyway, we're slicked back and I'm happy. I'm happy with the way it turned out. However, I'm currently wearing my Lululemon parcel that arrived, which I never got to show you. So in honor of my new running career, I got myself a Swiftly Tech fleece because that's what all the runner girls wear on TikTok. So I got a size six and it's in green. And what do you say? Or don't you pay attention to how dirty my room is over here. I'm changing my bed sheets and I haven't made them yet. Anyway, this is her. I love, and I got a scuba. So I got a Lululemon scuba. I'm chuffed, I love it. You know, I got a size medium large in the scuba, but I'm gonna put it on now because we're gonna go to the gym. And I just had a squares bar and everything. I can't believe I fucking recorded myself in slow motion. I'm a dopey dope. But anyway, it is funny content to watch. Oh yes, this was the other thing I showed you. Obviously too much my green claim which I've got going on here I got a new diary so fun story I was in Asda well no oh my god I've got to update well I did update you but I didn't fucking record myself properly so went to family dinner yesterday with granny I remember I told you I was going to try to get granny on the vlog she's bad me she said she's lucky I'm lucky that she's still putting prayers for me in her daily prayers because I put her in my story one day talking about the charity shop and it was really funny but granny did not think it was funny so yeah awkward anyway so we went for family dinner yesterday and then on the way back Owen rang me and he was like Keelan can you go to Asda and get a chocolate cake? So I went and I got chocolate cake so I got the like you know the tray one that you would have got in school with like the chocolate frosting on top that you, when you put in the microwave for 30 seconds it's unreal it tastes like hot chocolate fudge cake that's what I got unbelievable anyway so whilst I was there I found this so it just says weekly planner in gold but of course it's green so it immediately caught my eye but all the other diaries I've got they're very saturated, like every day has a different page, like Monday's on one day, Tuesday's on another day. And if I was to make a diary, I would keep it simple. I would keep it simple. We're not overcomplicating things. I want the week view, like I want the week view. And even if I had a day view, I would make day view a lot more simpler because like at the top, it has like, what am I grateful for? And um, what's the frog? Like what's the main priority today? And then like, what's the other cherries? And then all other things to do. And then you've got a schedule down here. And then it's like more gratitude at the bottom. But I'm like, I do my gratitude on my other one. Then at the start of every week, it has a habits page, which is totally understandable. However, I don't fucking use it. Like I don't use it. I just like track my habits to myself. But I know some people love that. I just, I just don't use it. So now, then I seen this and I opened it and it's got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Now the only thing that bugs me is that Saturday and Sunday aren't separate days because I'm like most of you, a lot of your plans are happening on Saturday and Sunday. Do you know what I mean? But I don't know. Love it. And then it just has like a little note section here. 
That's all I need. That's all I need because my gratitude's in a different book. <coughs> Sorry, the hairspray's trying to be the main character. My gratitude's in a different book altogether. So like, I've just chopped, and for three pound, I says straight in my basket. Thank you very much. Also, the other thing that I showed you whilst I was recording it in slow motion was this. My, that's all I've got on my face right now. This hair, right? This and like a little teeny bit of blush as well as the indestructible from Be Perfect. So I got this last week because Melissa Riddell had been raving about it for a few months and I thought I need a new eyebrow product because I had been using the Refay No Go. Loved it when I was in training because it did stay up but even after like a few hours it went white underneath. I don't know if I was applying it wrong but it just it wasn't the vibe. And then I was using this little NYX Brow Glue doesn't last a crack your eyebrows start coming like and I want mine glued to my head like I don't want them to move do you know what I mean but I had used the got to be glued stuff before and it was literally glued like it had like a hard coating on it and I hated that as well so I was like right as soon as this comes back in stock I'm getting it so I got it and I'm obsessed can you see my eyebrows like they still look like eyebrows as well and they're just so ever so lightly filled in at the corners with my revolution palette thing this little thing that I've had for years amazing so I love it and I did give a little tutorial on this here you just put it on as if it's moisturizer like just literally blah, 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 rub. no beauty blender required like chef's kiss so if you're having a rush and I got it on Amazon for 4 dollars I'll link it below and I'll link the indestructible brow and I'll link these Amazon the lululemon stuff that I got as well but oh my god unreal right let's get ready for the gym I'm now officially running late lol this is my favorite gym top for my protein this along with the reach vest these are my two favorites this is the L by the way I get I always size up on these things and then these are the lululemon lines and there's the back chuffed love it and also you can use I have a, I have a code with my protein if you need it so and it supports me too if you use it so love you if you do but I'll link this below okay and also the headband that I use for running, I'll link that below as well because I forgot to link that the other time. Right, let's put my scuba on. I have to say, scubas are quite expensive. Like, it's a hoodie, do you know what I mean? So the reason I got the scuba was because I had been buying the fourth arc fleeces and they're so reasonably priced, like so reasonably priced, but they're sold out and I was living in them. I was living in them. I got the green, the blue and the black, which you see me in anyway. And so then I thought, do you know what? It is, it really is the season of the half sip right now for me. So I thought... I am. I'm going to do it. I'm going to get a scuba. This is her and her glory. Pockets and all. Hoodie. I got the one with the hood. There is a full zip length, but I just went with this one. All plain black. Just because I was like, I don't want to get a colour one. Because I know that I'll wear the life out of the black. So I'm like, it's a safe option in case I don't actually like it. You know what I mean? But look. She's boss now. She's boss bitch. Five minutes. Sorted. Right. Off to the gym. Not me not realising this had little holes like this as well. Like the Swifty Tech. Chuffed. All black everything and then for shoes I always just wear my nanos which I will link for you I have a little Reebok link as well buzzing We are back from training and I have a haul and a grocery haul. Okay, let's go through it. So not a major, but just the basics, right? So we got some turkey, smoked turkey rashers. We got strawberries for the oats. I got these little things because I thought, you know what? They'll be handy like during sessions because they're 10 grams of carbohydrates and it's just pure, pure glucose. 
And we've got our little snacky snack because obviously we need a little chocolate treat in the evening. Got some brockers, bagels, bananas, beans, baby potatoes, mushrooms, turkey burgers. Amen, hallelujah, I love you. Yellow apples because I'm not a pink lady girl, no, no, no. And roast chicken breasts. And I had planned to maybe have the turkey rashers with some rice that I already have plus broccoli. But you know what, I just had a call and I'm thinking, I'm thinking I'm just gonna go with like a sweet chili chicken cheese bagel instead, something quick and easy because yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. So we'll make that. Welcome to our fort. We have been exiled from my bedroom. We don't do this all the time. We don't do this all the time. Good night. I'm looking very sleepy today. Slightly too sleepy for my own good. It's comp day. It's competition day. So we're up and at it this morning. It's like, what time is it? It's like half six or something or quarter to, quarter to seven. So Owen's coming now in 30 minutes and I need to have this ass ready for action. So we're going to get ready. We're going to make some breakfast. Let's go. Mm -hmm. 